Hello. Earlier today, I went and saw a movie called The Curious Case of Benjamin Button, starring Brad Pitt and Kate Blanchett. It's the story of this guy who was born as an old man and raised in an old folks home. The weird and interesting part is that this guy gets younger as he ages. One would think that this is a very interesting idea that hasn't been done before in movies and that there are all kinds of possibilities to make this an awesome movie. When I say awesome, I mean totally sweet. However, after... However, none of the ideas that you thought would make this movie sweet ever happen. In fact, it seems like they purposefully made this movie boring. The cinematography was great, the audio was great, but the story was not even a story. That's what's so strange. Most people age forwards and actually get older as time goes on. That's how it was for me. I was born when I was a baby, and as the days went by, I gradually became the age I am today. And tomorrow, I will be one day older than I am now. And that's about as interesting as it gets in this movie. I should make a movie about a guy who ages like a normal guy. And it would only be a teeny bit less boring than this movie. This movie was more boring than the first Hulk movie and longer than church on Sundays. It's like Forrest Gump, only not as good. Only not good at all. It's like the movie Batteries Not Included, but without the cute little robots. It's longer than King Kong, but without any good parts. It's like the writer said, let's make a movie about a normal, regular person's life that has nothing interesting in it, except that he gets younger and we'll just leave everything like a normal person's life and not put any story in there or anything and we'll just have people watch this guy get younger won't that be cool um, I bet as they were making this movie they realized that it was lacking something and decided to tack this part on at the beginning and at the end about this blind clockmaker who decides to make this clock that tells time backwards it runs backwards um, the funny thing is that this guy is blind and I don't think blind people can even tell the time using a clock they probably have some other method or device to help them tell time um, so I don't know why it really mattered that he was blind or that he made clocks. I think they were just thinking, let's throw this part in here because this guy made clocks go backwards and Benjamin Button's ages backwards. So that'll go together. And I don't see other than that how it really fits together. Um, another thing they did at the end of the story was try to wrap up the whole movie with a, with a moral, sort of like they do on Grey's Anatomy or Desperate Housewives. They show each character and they have some narration and the narrator says, So you can be an old man, an artist, a button maker, or a dancer in this life. So take your pick and enjoy. And that's about, that's basically the point of the film is that you can do any of those things and there's probably even more things to choose from than that if you think about it. But I think they could have come up with the same point in a 10 minute film. Um, yeah, just because a movie is about someone's life doesn't mean you have to make it as long as someone's life so don't see it don't rent it 
if you if you're in the mood for something exciting um, or a better story you can rent that fishing show bass masters where those guys go out and they they try to catch bass sometimes they do and sometimes they don't um, so yeah I'd recommend that over this one yeah yeah it sucked bad enough to encourage me to make a video about how bad it sucked I want my money back and my 16 hours of life that I wasted thanks and enjoy